¿Qué tal? My name is Sarah Suarez. I am one Latina among millions who have been immigrating to the United States for hundreds of years in search of a higher quality of life. We bring with us our cultural richness, our music, language, and traditions. We dance, sing, cook our favorite dishes, we raise our children, we move forward. We also work hard. We labor in fields and factories and restaurants. We start small businesses. We are educators, lawyers, doctors, performers, and politicians. Like most Americans, we love to shop. By the year 2011, our buying capacity will reach $1 trillion. Yet, many Latin Americans battle poverty, discrimination, and barriers to quality health care. To address the serious issues faced by underserved Latinos, in 1987, a small group of visionaries created the Latin American Health Institute. LHI grew to be a vibrant and successful service and advocacy organization for the Latino community. Our mission eventually expanded beyond HIV to focus on the overall health of our communities. LHI was born out of adversity. We had fire in our bellies and nothing Nothing was impossible. Now, decades later, with the Latino population expanding, LHI operates as a nonprofit public health community based organization. Its highly trained and dedicated staff provides health education, prevention, and care that focus on many health issues but also considers the whole individual and the entire family. For example, LHI asks, are pregnant women getting the prenatal care they need? Are our children getting the best possible start in life? In our programs for mothers-to-be, we provide medical advocacy and referrals as well as emotional and educational support. At our meetings, they learn good parenting skills and explore community resources. During home visits, we observe parents and children in their own environment and offer early positive reinforcement or suggestions. Our work with youth focuses on prevention first. They learn how to avoid HIV AIDS and how to discuss these issues directly. For people of all ages who fear having already contracted diseases or who have become addicted, we provide testing and ongoing support. Both immigrants and U.S.-born Latin Americans sometimes arrive at our doors struggling with substance abuse or lifelong mental health problems. What do our clients need to overcome their distress and remain healthy and vibrant? Our bilingual, bicultural staff provide counseling and psychotherapy in the client's own language from the client's own cultural perspective. LHI confronts issues that affect the whole person, the family, the ways that person functions in society. Our community health workers accompany clients to medical centers and social service agencies, where they serve as companions and interpreters, calming fears and clarifying. They make calls on the client's behalf and contact partnering agencies specialized in addressing specific challenges. Javier, sí, está disponible para este viernes, que vayamos a verlo este viernes a las 10 de la mañana. Yes, LHI has many programs to meet a variety of needs. How does LHI assure that its programs are of the highest quality and are based on the best practices and research? LHI's Center for Research and Culture collects and analyzes data about our programs and our constituencies. The center supports not only LHI's own programs, but also serves to inform public policy and healthcare practice. Now, perhaps you may ask yourself, what can I do to support LHI's efforts? You might volunteer, give to the annual fund, consider a gift annuity, become a staff sponsor by supporting a position that bears your name. Do you enjoy entertaining? You might host a house party. Interested in policy or social justice? Partner with us to promote changes in legislation. 
Are you an organizer? Help us plan events, attend our events. Latino Health Institute ha sido una gran pieza en mi recuperación mental eh, y también a nivel del VIH. Es una institución que ayuda a todas estas personas que han uh, sabido ya, uh, saben ya que tienen la enfermedad, pero se creen que no tiene alguien que le brinde una, una mano. By the year 2025, one quarter of American residents will be of Latin American origin. With your help, Latin American Health Institute will remain strong for decades, giving to the more vulnerable members of our community the tools they need to become productive members of the larger society. <laughs>